This is the AG5, an electric actuator from GP Fluid Control. It is ideal for controlling quarter turn valves, such as ball valves or butterfly valves. This all rounder is suitable for a multitude of industrial applications. The motor runs from open to close in about 13 seconds, and it's available in an open close and in a modulating version. The open close version is controlled with a three point signal, and here you use two steering signals one for open and one for close. We recommend not to use cables of more than approximately 3 meters to prevent any possible interference in the signal. And the actuator has no internal energy storage, so power is always required if you want to operate it. In the resting position, the motor is off and the actuator consumes hardly any power. All the power that it needs at that time is for the heating element that prevents any condensation in the housing. And the modulating version can be used to precisely control the valve position between open and close. The standard control signal is 4 to 20 milliamps, but you can also set this to 0 to 10 volts or 2 to 10 volts. In addition to that, the actual position of the actuator can be read out with a similar feedback signal. While all versions, so both the modulating and the open close versions, have limit switches at fully open and fully closed. Furthermore, the actuator has several safety functions, such as overload protection and a manual override. The AG5 is available in two voltages, 100 to 240 volts AC or 24 volts AC-DC version. You can mount the actuator on valves with a standard ISO 5211 flange in sizes F03, F05 or F07. The open-close version delivers up to 50 Nm and the modulating version 40 Nm. To make sure that the actuator fits and that the torque is sufficient, we have selected suitable combinations and tested them in-house here at Thameson. If you use your own valve, that's not a problem of course, but please pay close attention to the specifications of the valve. For large steel ball valves above 2 inches or butterfly valves above 4 inches, this actuator provides slightly too little torque. There are three reasons why the AG5 actuator is the perfect product for you. It has a reliable and gradual motor, the modulating version allows proportional control, and the limit switches, manual override, and overload protection are present by default. The AG5 actuator is a bit less suitable for very accurate or very fast flow control, and for these applications, other valves are somewhat better. Do you have any questions about GP Fluid Control's AG5 actuator or any other product? Please contact me or someone else from Thames.